Love staying informed? Subscribe now and get unlimited access to local news, weather, and sports for just 99 cents a month for your first three months at inform.news join. Read every story, listen to every podcast, and download the apps that keep you informed and on the go 24 hours a day. So head to inform.news slash join right now to subscribe. What are you waiting for? Get three months of local news for just 99 cents a month at inform.news slash join. Welcome to the Sports Minute Podcast, brought to you by the sports leader, WDAY. For more scores, highlights, and in-depth analysis, visit inforum.com slash sports. And now, here's our latest. Tonight, the hockey world turns its attention to Fargo. Toughest region in the NCAA tournament is right here, Cullen. Yeah, three Minnesota teams in one region certainly makes for some tough matchups in Fargo. St. Cloud State taking on Minnesota State. Huskies won the two regular season meetings. Midway through the second, Huskies get on the board. Vidi Mietnin walks it in, fires it home, and just a few minutes later, it's Jack Peart, the Fargo Force alum, doubles the lead for SCSU as the Huskies advance with a 4-0 win. That was, that was a big one for us, and, and it felt really good to get one here again. It's always cool to come back to a place you've played before, and, and this place holds a huge spot in my heart. On Saturday, Peart and the Huskies face the winner of this one, top seed Minnesota and Canisius. The Griffins putting up a fight early. There's Nick Bowman. Hopefully we sneak past you there. He puts the Griffs in front, but the Gophers respond just minutes later. Rozo's Aaron Huglin scoops up the loose puck, finds Twine. All Gophers after that. Minnesota is headed for Saturday. They're leading 8-2. to two. That'll do it for this episode of the WDAY Sports Minute. For the latest sports coverage from across the region, visit inforum.com sports and follow Inforum Sports on Facebook or Twitter. 